एंड कॉम सेमिस्टर फोर क्वेश्चन बैंक सॉल्यूशन कॉर्पोरेट फाइनेंशियल अकाउंटिंग वी आर डूइंग टॉपिक आई एफ आर एस एंड एंड एन ए एस प्रॉब्लम नंबर थ्री सो दिस इज योर प्रॉब्लम प्रॉब्लम सम द फॉलोइंग इन्फॉर्मेशन रिलेट टू मिस निम्बालकर कंपनी लिमिटेड अ लिस्टेड कंपनी विथ फाइव डिविजन ऑफ ऑपरेशन फॉर द इयर एंडेड मार्च थर्टी फर्स्ट ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन then they are given in the particular revenue for external customers and in the division a b c d e they have given 245 45 150 44 45. then we have a internal segment revenue which is given in the a b c segments then reported profit then we have a total asset which of the above business division are reportable segment under indian as 108 operating segment so this is your question from the given five division we have to find which is the reportable segment under indian as 108 operating uh, segment for this uh, to be you to be reported a uh, segment you should be ha having a 10% test of asset so this will be the criteria uh, so let's see the solution for the problem sum this is a solution same thing you have to copy here you can just copy whatever there in your question bank that is particulars a b c and d you will write first revenue from external custom as it is given in the uh, question so 245 45 150 40, 40, 44 then you will have one more a uh, column over here and there you will write the total in the revenue for external customer row Okay, so whatever total is there, 200 plus 45 plus 45 plus 150 plus 44. So if when you add up this, you will get a 484 as a total. Then you will write inter segment revenue. That is for A 20, B nil, C 5, D 20, E 2, and total is 47. so total revenue if you say uh, what will be the total revenue revenue for external customer plus int inter segment revenue will be your total revenue so you have to find out total revenue so you add on 200 plus uh, 20 it will be uh, 220 45 and in inter segment revenue we have we don't have anything that is nil so total is 45 then 45 plus 5 in segment number 6 uh, we have 50 then in um, Then in segment D we have 150 plus 20 that is 170. Then we have 44 plus 2 46. Okay. Then you will make the total of this which will come 4 521. Then as given in the problem sum you have to write reported profit. So you will copy the same figure 49 10 45 10 and you will take a total of this. Then you have a total asset 1500, 300, 400, 2000 and 400. The total of which will is 4600. Then here is your solution that is revenue percentage. So you first have to find out revenue percentage, then reported profit and total asset. So revenue profit is uh, revenue uh, percentage is important for our problem uh, solution. So how you are going to calculate the revenue prof uh, revenue percentage? See in the total revenue profit. profit you have 220 and the total which is come by adding all these five divisions is 531 so 220 divided by 531 in 200 you will get your revenue percentage that is 41.40% in the same way you will calculate for the b c d and e so you will just uh, take the uh, revenue or uh, to, sorry total revenue and uh, total of all uh, the segment okay and in 200 you have to do so in this way you will get the answer in all the columns of every segment okay so this is your answers then you have reported profit percentage the same way how you have done the total revenue you have to follow the same uh, procedure and you will able to find the reported profit so in the reported profit you have 40 and in the total side you have 4600 so for uh, sorry in the total side you have 114 so uh, reported profit is 14 uh, segment a and the total of it which is the uh, 114 uh, okay so when you add uh, all this five division you will get the total 114 so 40 divided by 114 into 100 uh, in the a segment you will get the answer 41.40 
in the same way you have to uh, 40 divided by 1 is you will get the answer 35.10%. Uh, okay, so your reported profit will be 35.4%. If you see in the B, you have in the re uh, revenue, uh, in the uh, reported profit, you have 9. So 9 divided by total that is 114 into 100. So you will have in the B segment, you will have reported profit 7.90%. In the same way, you have to find out C, D and E. Then in the total asset, you have in the same procedure, you have to follow. See, total asset is 1500 in column A. Okay, so 1500 divided by this 4600, the total of all the five segments. So 1500 divided by 4600 in 200. So you are going to get your profit, uh, sorry, total asset percentage as 32.60. Then in the B segment, you have 300. Okay, here you have total asset 300 divided by total of all the five segment that is 4600 into 100 6.50 similar procedure you have to follow for the segment c d and e and you will get your answer like this then from this segment you have to see that who has passed this criteria of 10 percent test for asset profit revenue so in the revenue uh, pr uh, revenue uh, percentage you will see which uh, segment is more than 10 percent okay so if you see your segment a is more than 10 percent b no it is less than uh, 10 percent c less than 10 percent 32 yes more than uh, 10 percent e less than uh, 10 percent so segment a and b meets the criteria of being more than 10 percent okay so reportable segment so you have to write your answer like this reported segment division a and division d is reportable segment as they meet the requirement of an operating segment as they meet the requirement of an operating segment the other three division do not meet the criteria none of them pass the 10 percent test for asset profit of revenue then additionally in INDS 108 states that if total external revenue reported by operating segment constitute less than 75 percent of entity revenue then the additional operating segment must be identified as a reporting segment cover 73.4 now who is a reporting segment over here a and b so when you add the revenue percentage the 41.40 plus 32 percent you will not get it as a 70 uh, 75 percent okay so it is 73.4 percent 73.4 percent okay which is less than 75 percent so you have to add on one more segment to reach the criteria of 75 percent so next best option which is available is uh, C because it has a 9.4 percent and then if you see the B it's 8.50 and E is 70 so we'll take a C segment uh, for adding uh, up and making and meeting the criteria of 75 percent so division C will be added as a reported segment to reach 75 percent revenue of entity okay so you will add a revenue of division c to reach the 75 percent revenue of entity so this is the way you are going to solve the problem okay so very easy problem only you have to remember certain steps that you have to follow uh, find out the revenue percentage reported profit percentage and total assets okay so for that first you uh, for finding the revenue percentage you should get a total revenue and how you are going to get a total revenue revenue from external customer plus inter segment revenue will be your revenue uh, total revenue and then you have to find out the percentage of everything so all the five segment you will add on the uh, add on and find out the total and then you will take one one segment divide the total into 100 you will get your uh, percentages okay so this is the solution for the problem number three so now for next uh, problem sir please subscribe and click on notification bell icon thank you